Hello everyone, and welcome back to King Koi, Golden Time, Mina's Route. It's her birthday week, yay! Happy, happy birthday, pin the tail on the seahorse! It was Mina-chan's birthday this week. Unfortunately, it fell on a weekday, and I didn't like the idea of celebrating her birthday after the day had already passed. So we skipped it. <laughs> that would be terrible after all this buildup. <laughs> After some discussion, we decided to celebrate her birthday a few days earlier on our day off. That works. I mean, actually, when you think about it, in uh, Reina's route, there is the build-up to the party, and we never go to it. Oh yeah, you're right, I forgot about that. That's a good yeah. point. I'm really nervous. I wouldn't feel so tense if this were any other ordinary outing. There was only one reason I was so on edge. One? Really? Okay. I have to make absolutely sure I don't screw up. I wanted to show her a good time. And with it, I wanted her to see me as a man, to show feelings for me. A big, strong man. A man in tights. I wonder if she's almost here. Our meetup time was drawing near. She was the one person I couldn't imagine being late, so I was sure she'd turn up soon enough. It's okay, we were just talking to ourselves. Oh yeah, you're right on time. Us too. Huh? Uh, I see. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's true. She got beat red and hung her head. Adorable. Uh, shall we? Uh, here, take my hand. I've got to escort a princess, isn't that right? I can, it definitely wasn't take three. <laughs> <laughs> She softly put her hand in mine. I was going to give it my all today, so I never had to let go of her warm hand. You'll just have to wait and see. Then it wouldn't be a no. surprise. No, it's a secret. It's so secret, even I don't know where we're going. Watch that be the twist. It might actually be. No, I think he had something planned. Yeah, think, I'm sure he I does. think he did. Yeah. Let me handle everything today. This is to celebrate your birthday. I don't know how you celebrate birthdays in Sortilege, so it may not be all that luxurious. I promise to make it a day you'll never forget. Yeah, more, more or less. Uh, I think it pretty much comes out of his ass, I'll be honest. Mm, yeah, there's a lot of hot air behind it. Ooh. Uh, from my love for you. No promises. I made that comment out of the blue, knowing full well I'd get that sort of reaction out of her. Yep, that's totally it. I can't tell you how happy it made me when he started calling me by my first name. Yeah, now that I think about it, we haven't been bleeding for a while. Holy crap. I was going to die by cuteness overload. You could take away the rose-colored glasses from my love for her, and she'd still be bursting with sheer adorableness. 
するのをやめてくださいまし、no, シマリのない顔をするのはみっともないですわよ。Well, then you can buy us a mirror. Sorry, sorry. I'll make sure to be serious while I show you around. You're just a stone face the entire time. I really should try to regain her trust. Now then, how could I get her to believe in me? Oh, hello. Oh. Ba -ba -ba. Let's see. Gaze into her eyes, whisper sweet nothings, or squeeze her hands softly. I feel like she has commented that our looks are sketchy and our words sound mean, so maybe squeezing her hand is the safe route? But I feel like whispering that... sweet nothings would be funnier. I was about to say. I think that's gonna be the, the funniest. Alright, whisper sweet nothings it is. Oh, you're the only one who gets to see me, Nina chan. Oh, hi. I wouldn't do this with anyone else, only someone special. <laughs> huh? Mina, Mina chan? Oh no, we should have just squeezed her hand. Why? Mm, got it. I'll do just that. The time and scenery all slowly passed by as I walked at Mina Chan's pace. Although it wasn't far to get where we were going, I wanted to have a fun time talking to her. We arrived at the place we'd be celebrating her birthday. CG! Well, yeah, that's the idea. It looks simple, but it's surprisingly difficult. And she gets it on the first try. She took on the water balloons with ample enthusiasm. It loses strength when it gets wet, so it'll tear when you add the water balloons, wait. I'll give it a try first, so you can get a feel for it. Wow, let me see what you got. First, she observed closely. She should be a beginner, but she was so focused, she exuded the air of an expert. A red water balloon was floating in front of her. She had a good eye. If she played her cards right, the balloon did look the simplest. Oh! The handle got a little wet, but she reeled it in. Snap. Ah, too bad. Maybe you talk too hard. This is how they get you. Exactly. And they got her money, hook, line, and sinker. Difficult, right? It doesn't go well until you figure it out the trick. Aw, she was all fired up. Yeah, that did sound like her given how competitive she could be. Uh, 
you'll lose every time if you get too worked up, up over it, Mina-chan. She pulled herself together and went in for a fourth time. I could sense Mina-chan's determination when she reached out for the first water balloon. Oh, looking good. I was glad we'd come here after seeing how serious she was acting over water balloon fishing. Yeah, that looks good. Oh, congrats, Mina-chan. You scored your first water balloon. She was positively over the moon. That smile alone made today's date all the more satisfying. She's on fire! Huh? Another for me? Alright, I'm counting on you for another one. Which? Ah, I see it. That's not an excuse so they don't have to draw a different colored CG at all. Look, don't ruin the illusion. So we'd be a matching pair? The thought made me kind of eager. Yep, people who are good at this can apparently fish up multiple in a row. Uh, there's no reason to go crazy with it, is there? Taking the full effort approach to everything was so like her. Super good, you caught on to the trick quickly. <laughs> oh boy. Snap. Uh. <laughs> yeah, because you let your guard down. Hubris. Uh, no, no, I'm sorry, I couldn't help it. But you got really into it, it was all. Incidentally, should we, uh... We should totally never take her to Vegas, right? Oh, no. No. That would be a terrible idea. Yeah. Oh, isn't that a new goal? Yeah, that's been our uh, expert planning idea every single route. Yep. Oh, does that mean you're gonna try to fish up two in a row then? Yes, I know what we're doing for the rest of the day. A fire had seemingly been ignited under her. I'd better keep her company for the time being. After water balloon fishing, we enjoyed candy apples, cotton candy, and other cheap temple fair staples. 
Thanks to her experience with snacking on takoyaki before, she was able to eat them without any major hiccups. Yep. Coupled with the novelty of it all, we spent our entire date smiling from ear to ear. That was a minor hiccup. Uh, yeah, time flies when you're having fun. We headed home together after sunset. Our shadows were stretched out behind us as we made our way home at a leisurely pace. It was on the smaller side, though. Uh, there's bigger ones over the summer with fireworks and stuff. They aren't like that in Sortilege? ええ。日本の花火は丸いのでしょ。ええ。Oh, I get it, like the ones they set off after a baseball game. You know a lot about fireworks. That's a little scary. Wow. How about that? Yeah, it, it's a while off, but let's make a promise. Alright, let's make our promise Japanese style. Would you put out your pinky? When in doubt. I wrapped my pinky around hers, then said the phrase I was so familiar with. Pinky promise. If I lie, swallow a thousand needles till I die. It's a promise. Ella comes running out of the woods. What did you just say? <laughs> no, that would be if we made it with Sylvie. Yeah, yeah, you're right. It's a game of sorts that kids play all the time. Ow, my pride. Given her physical appearance, it was overwhelmingly more appropriate for someone like her. Oh, right. Are you sure you're okay with what I got you for your birthday? When I brought up wanting to give her a birthday present, she thought it over a minute, picked up something on the spot, and said, This will do. Eh? This will do. On her finger sat a toy ring worth only a few hundred yen. I bought it for her since she had picked it out, but I personally thought it was anticlimactic. I mean, at least it's not a ring pop. Well, yeah, but you can eat a ring pop. True. <laughs> really, if you're sure it's okay. Ooh, okay. Ring pop it is. Uh, how much? Just, just, just ask. So this one, eh? No, 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 no way. As if a student like me could afford that. So the ring is a promise of things to come? I see. Oh, right. So, no pressure. <laughs> we continued our conversation. Topics varied quite a bit from things that had been on our minds for ages to sharing personal things that we could only talk about now that we were on a date. 
No matter how much time we had to get to know each other, it would never be enough. Even as the sun set, we paid it no mind and kept up our leisurely walk. No matter how slowly we walked, we would eventually reach our destination. We're here. Ah, uh, we'd better stop holding hands. Dots. I don't wanna. I didn't want to let go. I didn't want to let go. I knew we felt the same without us having to say it to each other. Mina-chan, wanna come to my room? You like French films? <laughs> you like big French films? <laughs> <laughs> I'll make drinks. Have a seat. Sure. She tugged on me with her tiny hand, and I sat next to her. Like, good strange, or like that carnival food is coming back on you strange? Huh? Sure, I want to be with you too. We cuddled up. She leaned her small frame against me and gently held my hand. It gets my heart racing, though. <laughs> Didn't you feel peaceful? Well, then, I'll make your heart beat even harder. Ooh. I hugged her a bit forcefully. As she plopped snugly into my arms, I felt how warm and soft she was. Mina-chan, I feel the same. I don't want to be apart from you. I've wanted to do this for ages. I love you, Mina-chan. Yay! Yay!隣で王路が笑ってくれる。それだけで私は幸せな気持ちになりますの。これが恋というものなんですのね。Uh, that would be great if th that were the case. These feelings... These feelings must be romantic love. I can't tell you how happy it makes me to hear you say that. <laughs> For sure. It was strange. My heart should have been racing from the tension, anxiety, and countless other emotions I was feeling. Am I? え。今も私の心を好きをどんどん大きくしてくれてますわ。1分1秒ごとに心をもっと好きになって離れたくなくなって。I could ask the same of you. I never thought I'd feel this way about you. I guess that's how it would go. I couldn't stop these feelings. 
These feelings that spilled out from deep inside my chest. These feelings of love. Our lips met. Mina-chan eagerly pressed her lips back against mine. Her sweet fragrance rushed directly into my brain, and it felt like every part of me was going to go numb. Kissing you feels really nice. She begged me as she blushed. This was against the rules. One more time then. It was like every nerve had focused on my lips. Her softness, along with her even squishier lips, felt fantastic. She and I both became utterly engrossed in our second kiss. My instincts were howling. What should I do to ask for more? <laughs> that might do it. I don't know what it was, but yeah. I parted her lips with my tongue, and she reacted with a startled jump. I wrapped around her tiny tongue for dear life in response. My mind was in a state of pure chaos from the overwhelming happiness and excitement I felt. For some reason, I read pure chips. Because I guess I'm hungry. I was just filled with pure chips of deliciousness. Same here. Your lips are so sweet and soft, I could get addicted to them. You can't have just one. You gotta have... Two? <laughs> Several. Minochan's embarrassment only fanned the flames of my already burning desires. Saucy. You're fine with just kissing? Huh? I want you, Mina-chan. I wanted to make Mina-chan mine. And I told her how I felt point-blank. Mina-chan? Wait, is that what I... Oh, haha, I get the joke. A little slow to the uptake on that one, but that's okay. I got there eventually. Yeah, I want all of you to do more erotic things with you. She hesitated for a moment, then said, She squeezed my hand that rested on hers and gazed straight up at me. I'll be honest. Hmm. A part of me was half thinking that she'd say after that, but we already held hands. <laughs> I mean. Ooh, you didn't use Ella's study material, did you? Yeah, please don't have. She told me just how certain she felt. And then dots. So many dots. Still going with dots. You see, this is the problem. Nobody will give us a mirror. I mean, what, are we Quasimodo? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Sanctuary! <laughs> 
She took a quick shower and collected her clothes. I mean, when you think about it, how many times have we really seen his back in CGs? Eh, eh, eh. I wanted to get in together, but she said it would be too embarrassing and turned me down. Even though, technically speaking, we have been in the shower together, although I don't think that was the canon choice. Oh, you're leaving. I was convinced we would spend the night together. Oh, come on. What's the odds that she does that? Uh, What number would it be? At least twice. What, what are the odds that Akane would come in for like the eighth time? <laughs> You're so diligent. Oh, I thought you meant like coming in and just ripping off the covers and being like, boing, squish, <laughs> what? No, I mean like uh, the wake up counter. Oh, oh, yeah, no. Between this and the previous game, it's in the double digits. It's a lot. Yeah. No. Yeah, see you tomorrow. What's up? So the aorta is the largest blood vessel. Oh, you don't mean literally. She jumped up to reach the back of my neck and tugged me down to her. Oh, I'm just imagining her just jumping up to try and pull us down for a kiss and just like, get down here. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. Isn't it sly of her to change that much? I don't know, that seems pretty common for these. Okay, I'm heading home. Oh, yeah. And more or less. いちまつくんとゆっくり語りたいことがあるんですけど仕方ないですねうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんう
I never knew someone spoiling me could feel so wonderful. <laughs> Which is why today it's my turn. One was not better than the other, we were equals. It was with that mindset that we came up with the idea to swap who spoils the other each day. It would definitely help with my mental health, and I couldn't deny how well this arrangement suited us. Ah, uh, this feels so nice and calming. Same. This really is the most soothing thing ever. Can I make it race faster? Now that I'd gotten her permission, I leaned in. We shared an affectionate kiss. I wholeheartedly put my love into it and went gently and peacefully to start. Things got more heated as we went on, and I started to wrap my tongue around hers. I was utterly intoxicated in a matter of seconds and couldn't hold myself back anymore. Mina-chan. 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 You do a really good job of fixing your hair without that mirror. We were so focused on making out that it was nighttime before we realized it. I've worked up an appetite. Why don't we have dinner? Then again, all I had on hand were instant noodles. I'd better go buy something. Uh, Mina-chan, is there anything you'd like to eat? Mm -hmm. Okay, then. Talk about wild. I want to gobble you up, too. I really hope those are noodles. Delicious. Oh no, we'll have to exercise more. What can we do? What can you do? It's past 10 already. This is what we got for making out so long. All of the convenience shops in the dorm were obviously closed, so I wound up slurping on cup noodles together with Mina Chan. Will we? Maybe. You sure are a hard worker. Oh no. Wait, what? I mean, I'm fine with anything really, as long as it's, you know, as long as it fills up my belly. I didn't stand a chance against this expression of hers. I get it. I'll make sure I'm careful too. 
Sounds good to me. Uh, are you are you sure? Sokujinoshtako Oh man, what should I do? She was an angel. Too late. Anything you've made for me will be delicious, guaranteed. That, that makes sense. The girl I fell in love with was hardworking and kind through and through. It made me think to myself that I was going to fall more and more deeply in love with her the longer we were together. <laughs> Uh, you're going home already? That's probably true. Yeah, true. We'll see each other again tomorrow anyway. To finish saying goodbye, I leaned down. For some reason, I imagine he's not, like, leaning. He just, like, fucking squats. He's just getting in the catcher pose. <laughs> yep, that's what I imagined. <laughs> <laughs> you are really sly, Mina-chan. Come on, slide it home. There's so many jokes that could be made off that. I know, right? Are we? Huh? Uh, where's that coming from? <laughs> How we've been pretty much, pretty much, pretty, pretty much normal. <laughs> yeah, pre pretty much. There was a reason I dodged answering. Dodge! <laughs> the day after we expressed our feelings for each other... I thought it was gonna flash to something different. I did too? I really did too, because my response was going to be DOTS! That we're dating? Mina, why does your voice and our memory sound like you're in the bathroom and we're conversing from outside? Wouldn't it be better if we at least told Sylvie and our friends? I've gotten a lot of advice from them about you, so I'd like to let them personally know. Okay, but you're gonna have to tell Exena to come down from the ceiling. Got it. If that's what you want, then that's what we'll do. And that led us to now. Ah, she's just been coming over to my place, teaching me etiquette, and having meals with me. Really? Ella just looks into her eyes and says, You're lying. I want to make a quick trip to the bathroom. She seemed likely to pry, so I bailed. Oh no. Hmm? 
ミナル様のことで少々最低限の警護などはしますがお二人の関係を詮索はしませんのでご安心を<笑> Thanks That would be a major help それだけですでは失礼 I followed after Elisan as she turned around back toward the classroom. Yeah, I'm sure she's seen straight through us. Mm hmm. Just how quiet could I keep this? Let's ask Rhea. Thank you. We were well in the middle of etiquette lessons. I believe I needed a bare minimum of etiquette to be a good match for her. She happily accepted when I told her I wanted to keep this trend going. Sure is. What do you want to do? Hmm? Sure, I can. I stayed seated in place just as she asked. Uh oh. <laughs> don't say what do you want for Christmas, little girl. Don't say what do you want for Christmas, <laughs> little girl. What do you want for Christmas, little boy? boy? <laughs> 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 yep. <laughs> uh. She was all smiles today. Almost childish, huh? Just like our senses of humor. <laughs> Not at all. You're tiny, so there's clearly no need to worry so much. Fine, you're very heavy. Oh, that feels like it's probably not smart to say either. <laughs> this is what you call a no-win situation. Uh, you're the one who asked me if you were heavy or not, though. She ain't heavy, she's my girlfriend. I personally think you're pretty. Have you not paid attention to the dot 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 scenes? For real. She was there. Yeah, I love it. <laughs> all smiles and elated all over again. I had gotten a better idea of how to keep her under control the longer we were together, so I'd gotten a lot better at putting her in a good mood. Oh, right! Minachan! Happy birthday! <laughs> Of course I did. It's the birthday of the girl I love. Literally one of the few things we can remember. Well, that was then, and this is now. We have to celebrate on the day of, too. I was excited to celebrate your birthday as your lover, too. Is there anything you want me to do for you? If you ask now, I'll do anything you want in return. Can you give us a hint? Anything. Huh. You gave me the most complicated answer possible. Anything's fine. Just try and tell me whatever's currently on your mind. Yeah, as long as it's something I'm capable of doing. So no buying a plot of land and building a house. Holy crap. This level of cuteness was against the rules. Minachan, 
turn this way. Oh no! You need to knock. Ah. Mina Chen hurled herself straight off my lap. Her sense of balance really was impressive as she stuck the landing to boot. I hold up a sign that says 10. Yes. No, no, nothing like that. Yes. Act better. Reyna, you already ruined the moment. Leave. <laughs> wow, that joke had layers. That joke had so many. It was great. Minachan just finished wrapping up her lecture. So, so what do you need? It's a hands-on curriculum. Yes, please do. I wish you'd done that from the start. <笑>了解。あ、最後にもう一つ。私は応援してるよ。オールのことも神谷のことも大好きだからね。うん。そんだね。私たちのこと。you know, of all the people we probably should have asked to say nothing, it should have been her. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I did go to her for advice, but she's good at reading the room. That's true, she really is. Well, who am I supposed to- I've got, like, one guy I could ask for advice. Would you rather we ask the internet? That's not very reliable. What else was I supposed to do? I figured it couldn't hurt to ask another girl for help. You do. This was a side of her I had only gotten to know after we started to date. I had learned that Mina-chan was actually a ridiculously jealous person. Oh no. Hey, wait, wait, wait. Isn't it a little, uh, too early to go home? I asked for their help because I really wanted to be with you. Yeah, I mean, what do you want us to do? Ask your advice? Hey, Mina-chan, how do I get with Mina-chan? Of course, you know that too, don't you? But whenever she realized a fault in herself, she recognized and apologized for it right away. Mina-chan. She was an honest, wonderful girl to everyone. Yeah, and I think that's a wonderful thing. Everyone supports us. Except for probably your whole country. We'll cross that bridge when we get to it. If we get to it. Maybe in the appended route? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it was. I mean, we still can. We just might want to lock the door this time. This is playing a little, a little uh, fast and loose, but you want to try it again? Five bucks says Rhea barges in next. We slowly brought our faces together. Oh, no. Uh -huh. <sighs> Sounds like it. Wonder who it is. 
Talk about terrible timing. Who the hell was interrupting my precious time with Mina-chan? Oh. Oh, it's Sylvie. Okay. I answered the phone. Hello? It's rare for you to call me. What's up? Yeah, she is. Why? I'd be happy to pass along the message. Got it. What's wrong? It was your sister. Totally not our fault. Yeah. I knew how lonely Mina-chan could get, so I feigned some ignorance on top of it all. <laughs> Sorry. Here, Mina-chan, come over. I bet you're right now. Now it's gonna be Uriya. Uh, probably. I held her gently in my arms as we kissed. We'd gotten used to this position fairly quickly, so I knew just how to sit to make kissing easier. Did I manage to satisfy you? Why was I being provoked? She wanted me to tell you that ex san was planning to come by your place later. I guess that means we can't drag this out for too long, huh? You can't ignore her, can you? It had been important enough for Sylvie to go out of her way to call about. I couldn't exactly stand in the way if she had some important business to attend to. <sighs> Leroy Jenkins? Leroy! <laughs> Sorry. Uh... Huh? What? Um, but, um, I have questions. I, I feel like there are flaws in this plan. Uh, yeah, probably. Numerous flaws. But we've not been in here for this before, so that's something. Yeah, makes sense to me. You think this will be all right? I'm honestly a little afraid that I'm going to ruin your beautiful sheets or couch. Yeah, I guess it'll work out. <laughs> Our kiss earlier wasn't nearly enough for me either. Our passionate kiss encouraged Mina-chan to reciprocate further by wrapping her tongue around mine. Even so, this might have been a little too intense. <laughs> oh, no. Hey, Mina-chan. But Exeno will be here soon. She was incredibly horny today. By the looks of it, semi-forceful kisses were what turned Mina-chan on. The only way to pacify her in this condition was to satisfy her desires. Uh, will you listen to what I have? What I say then?
What did we say? I want to know what we said. I feel like we're missing important stuff. Okay, I'm gonna head back to my room. Nah, I bet she's already outside. We just pa we pass her on the way out. Just nod. Oh, yeah, that that's right. I forgot X and Asan was supposed to come by Mina-chan's place. I had other things on my mind. I had so much fun teasing you that it just kind of happened. Okay. Yeah, I bet. I'd better bolt sooner than later. Etiquette lessons. <laughs> Where did Eggs and Hassan come from? I don't know if that makes me feel better or worse. Right. Was Eggs and Hassan mad? Uh, how long have you been here? Oh shit. Um... I Thank you. She knew! She knew for sure! Oh, she knew I think you actually might need to tell her that, but I'm not going to say that because I don't want to be sleeping with the fishes. It'd be worse than that. Like, we'd get Jimmy Hoffa. They just never see us again, ever. Yeah. yeah. I will keep that in mind. Understood. Scary. That look in her eyes was intense. Yes. Huh? She left. Was that Exna's way of showing support for us? Nice. Scary, but nice. All right, so that's going to be it for this episode. And what an eventful episode it was. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge, dots, dots, dots. Lots of dots. Say no more, say no more. Boy, uh, she dialed up things pretty, pretty quickly after that date. That, that escalated quickly. But I'm wondering what is going to come next now. So we've got... Yeah. We're very much in the relationship aspect. I'm guessing there's got to be some sort of... Everybody's being really supportive, so I don't know what the obstacle's going to be. But there's got to be something. Yeah, actually. There is no conflict right now, really. Actually. The only thing I can really think of at this point is public relations, international relations. But that seems a little bit too large, if that makes sense. Because I feel like that's not a, that's not a surmountable obstacle within the time frame of one of these games, unless it was like the whole game. But yeah, I don't know. I guess we'll just find out. Anyway, we hope you enjoyed this episode, and we hope to see you in the next one. For now, we are the Bridge Boys signing off. <laughs>